What is cloud computing? Um, cloud computing is a current IT industry term for describing a model for delivering software applications through the web. Um, and it's actually an encompassing term that includes different concepts around software product delivery that you may be familiar with. Concepts such as hosted applications or ASP or delivering software as a service. Um, it has all of these elements plus some from Web 2.0 or virtualization. So it's really an umbrella term for all of these recent trends in software product delivery through the internet. But what's really important to understand is two things. The deployment model for cloud computing applications and the business model. And on the deployment side, we think of a cloud application as one that is remotely hosted, shared by multiple users, and accessed via the internet or the cloud. And on the business model side, it's a different method for charging for software, whereby the user only pays for what they consume. How does cloud computing and software as a service change the Walters Kluwer business model, but also impact upon your customers? Um, well, cloud computing represents uh, the next step in the evolution of how we deliver our integrated software suites to customers. Um, as you may know, uh, WK has been investing um, in workflow automation for our customers and moving our products up the value stream from primary research content to integrated software suites. What cloud computing represents is another model for delivering these applications to customers. And it's a model that we believe is more efficient for customers because it allows them to implement the applications more quickly at a lower cost and maintain them at a lower cost going forward. Um, and also because cloud applications can be connected through connected to so easily through the internet, it encourages a community of users around the application. And from that community, you get deeper collaboration and sometimes even marketplaces developing with the WK workflow suite at the center of it. What do you mean when you talk about the establishment of marketplaces within cloud computing? Well, cloud computing allows us you know, first to deliver the application more effectively through the internet. And because connections to the internet are becoming um, near ubiquitous at this point, uh, it's easy for a whole host of users and related parties to connect to a WK workflow application that's delivered through the cloud. Well, because of the number of users, what we're finding is our um, our productivity suites delivered through the cloud are becoming collaboration platforms for our customers. And often from those collaboration platforms, it evolves into a marketplace. So for example, um, we own a business called App One, which is part of our financial services customer unit. And what App One does, um, it has created a marketplace whereby independent used car dealers that need to find credit options for their customers can interface with lenders from around the country that want to provide loans to that marketplace. So in this case, delivering the application through the cloud, it's much more than an efficient model for delivering the software. It's actually connecting the demand side of an equation with the supply side of the equation. Um, in this case, that for automobile financing. Um, why do you believe that cloud computing is going to allow you to access adjacent markets? Um, it's in the nature of the applications themselves. Um, by remotely hosting an application, it makes it easier to um, integrate it with offerings from multiple different parties. So for, um, again, the, using the example of App One, um, what we have done there is we have integrated in products and services from other companies that are relevant to uh, the transaction of purchasing a used vehicle. So for example, a, um, a, uh, a lender will be interested to know about the condition of the vehicle, the residual value of the vehicle over time, um, and uh, credit information about the potential borrower. So we've been able to integrate into our App One Cloud application services from these different types of providers to make it a more complete solution for customers. But a lot of people in the marketplace are going to be moving towards cloud computing. So why will Walters Kluwer stay ahead of the game? Um, 
Well, you're right. I mean, the marketplace uh, for IT services is certainly shifting towards software as a service and, and now cloud computing. Um, and I think it's important to understand uh, the skills that an organization needs in order to be successful at delivering applications through the cloud. So first think about the traditional software model where the software was licensed to an individual customer with the expectation that it would be significantly customized to meet the specific needs of that customer. Cloud computing is a little different. Um, in cloud computing, you need to have deep knowledge of a specific marketplace. And at WK, we talk about our deep knowledge of our vertical marketplaces and the ability and the disciplines to gain insights on customer needs in those marketplaces and to translate those into the requirements for your application. Because really, you're building a product for an entire marketplace, not for a single customer. So you have to access and understand a range of market needs and then be able to translate those effectively into the requirements for your application. And that's a discipline that we have been investing in at WK for many years now, and increasingly it's becoming part of our DNA. So I think what differentiates us is, um, again, the deep market positions we hold in our various niche markets, and also the customer insight disciplines that we've embedded throughout the organization to gain the knowledge and the requirements that we need to build industry-leading applications.